Well, it's an upcoming one night concert designed to benefit immigrants from Ukraine. It's coming up next Thursday at 730 at Portland's Alberta Rose Theater. Stephen Redland takes us behind the scenes tonight. My gorgeous sea flute, which is a Powell instrument and absolutely stunning. One of my personal favorites is this gorgeous alto flute, which sounds a fourth lower. And then we've got the bass, which is a full octave lower. Amelia Lucas is a professional musician and performer rehearsing her latest compositions that honor the concept of home. The Russian invasion of Ukrainian homes is the focus of her upcoming concert, Natural Homeland, Honoring Ukraine. Partnering with and playing at the Alberta Rose Theatre. They too believe in this cause and believe in the value of this kind of performance. Her one night concert is a mix of music, art and dance and is dedicated to the stories of displacement and disaster in war-torn Ukraine. Highlight the conflict and create a container to process some of the emotions associated with that through this music. Experience a sort of emotional unity resolution and a glimmer of hope, at least. When the war began, Ukrainian-born artist Tatyana Doronka sold all her paintings to raise humanitarian funds for Ukraine. A potential buyer's comment surprised her. Oh, I love this flag painting. I'm like, the flag painting? Oh, I've been making Ukrainian flag paintings. I didn't know about it. I really wanted to have imagery that represented the joy and hope as well as resilience and the staying power of my people. As a painter and muralist, Tatiana's experience as an immigrant influences her focus on joyful moments. Paint live during one of the pieces. The piece is only seven minutes long, so it will be quite a challenge, but I'm up for it. An auction of that painting will raise funds for the local immigration and refugee community organization's mission. Nobody have to go through what they go. They don't deserve it. Nobody deserves this. Ukrainian immigrant Irina Cherdyko is with the Slavic and Eastern European Center. She helps those who immigrate here to again find the comforts that war has destroyed. Pay their rent, help to pay their medical bills, or even uh, groceries, find diapers for their children, wheelchairs. <laughs> The concert that honors those escaping a war-torn home, natural homeland honoring Ukraine, is supporting the search for peace, safety, and community in a new place. By feeling through some of these emotions, letting them go, processing them together, we can all live a little bit more lightly. In Northeast Portland, a world away from war, I'm Stephen Redland, KGW News.